What's going on? So today was an interesting day. I just got back from a vlogger, blogger meetup. Very good. It's important for people who do things like this to have um, connections and collaborate with other like-minded individuals. Uh, but that's not what I wanted to talk to you about. Uh, and I don't even want to talk to you about this, but as you know, I'm teaching now. And uh, this past week was the first week that we had students. Thursday and Friday and uh, here's a, a quick like clip of me bringing stuff in and this is just a little bit of stuff check this out It's the beginning of another school year. I'm excited. Woo. Third year in. Man, I'm a teacher. Awesome. Awesome. Yeah, but even though you just watched that clip, this video is not about my first week in school either. This video is about how I went from almost being homeless, being a single father, and almost homeless and jobless to now having a teaching career and um, a comfortable place to live and uh, being at a comfortable space right now. And uh, a lot of people that have been in a similar situation that I was in really had a tough time and they gave up. Um, and I just want to talk to you a little bit about the things that was, that, that contributed to me not giving up. and. Uh, me pressing on and uh, one of the first things that I leaned on was my relationship with God I really connected with God in a much deeper way and it's funny how when you don't have and you are living without and you're in a place of desperation and you don't even know where your next meal is coming from how close of a relationship somebody can develop with the Creator um, and I saw God's grace move tremendously and provided yeah, I think they're singing for you guys so God moved tremendously in a way that I was able to provide for my sons even when I didn't have and uh, how uh, we went from a three bedroom house to a small one bedroom apartment how um, and, and even then we had a place to live. We had somewhere to, to live, you know. Uh, it was just amazing, right? But I never really gave up on God. And in fact, I saw God's sovereignty in such a rich way. And that scripture where Paul talks about, I can do all things with Christ who give me strength. How Paul said that he could go, he, can, he knows what it's like to have and what it's like to have not. And how he can endure all things that's presented to him because it is Christ who gives him strength and I saw God's strength in me and he gets all the glory for all that because I could have given up but um, God's sovereignty His grace kept me going um, second thing is I found purpose and that purpose was in me doing better for myself so that I can do better for my kids um, and I didn't put it on anybody else like in fact the reason why I was almost homeless is because I was sort of not dependent on somebody else it's just um, I didn't have it was just a, a really weird time where um, I was alone I didn't know who to go to um, I didn't have much help and it allowed me to lean on God and for me to get up out of that I needed purpose and I found purpose in making sure that my sons would be taken care of so I worked hard I worked hard and I found something that I can do I was going back to school and it, I wasn't going back to school so that I could just get an education and find a job. I was going back to school so that I can um, raise the bar for my son so that they can reach that level and go even higher than what I reached. So my purpose was to create a better situation for myself so that my sons can see it and create better situations for themselves. So I found purpose. So I didn't stay rock bottom because I had a purpose. So I had God. 
I trusted in his sovereignty and I found purpose. And the last thing is I never gave up. I wanted to give up. Things got hard. I wanted to give up. I wanted to quit and I never quit. And um, some, some of you out there right now may be watching this and you want to quit too. I want to encourage you not to quit. Keep going. And if you don't have God in your life, connect with God. And if you don't have purpose, if you don't know what it is that you have to do, so or, or the thing that you want to achieve, um, or uh, a connection to something greater than yourself, like a purpose, find that. Find something greater than yourself. Because me bettering my situation for my sons is greater than better, bettering the situation for myself. So uh, there's three things that I did to come out from the low place that I was at to be where I'm at now. And I'm no, in no means where I need to be or where I want to be. I'm still growing, but I'm not where I used to be. And those three things was me connecting with God in a deeper way. I, found, I really found who God was. Um, I had purpose, and that purpose was for me to better myself so that my sons would be better. And uh, three, I never gave up. If you apply those things to your life, you can accomplish almost anything. All right? So that's my spill for the day. Hope it blesses you. And uh, I'm going to let the birds continue singing. All right? God bless. I'm out. Don't forget to like this video if you liked it. If you didn't like it, click the unlike button twice. Subscribe. Click the bell notification. It'll tell you when I upload new videos. And I appreciate you for watching. I'm out.